Hello, welcome, Cabbage here. In War of the Visions, let's have a look at the banners for New Year's. And then we'll also look at uh, kind of the shops and stuff for the Crystal Fest units. Uh, but here we have a uh, New Year's gift. This is a free pull. Uh, last year we got uh, the letters that spell out Happy New Year in Japanese. And then you could sell them for uh, Gil. Uh, but here we will get uh, gifts from characters of the game. <laughs> Alrighty. Durando and Gargas New Year's gift. That's funny. <laughs> uh, Durando and Gargas. Here is Inori, uh, Grace, Durando and Gargas, uh, Tsubayaki, okay, uh, Murmur, Inori, and then depending on the uh, rarity, Inori, of the uh, character here, that's kind of how much of the uh, the gift is worth. And Sasayaki, yay, Whisper. <laughs> Alright, I'll take a photo of that. And then 1600 Vision Ore. Uh, so we'll get this over five days, uh, depending on uh, who or like what rarity of uh, characters you get. Uh, you'll get more Vision Ore. The max is 2,000. Uh, the least will be 1,000. And then I'm looking at the uh, the gifts, and then they have stories. So I'm going to take photos of those and then read them later. And then I'm seeing if... Uh, these stories are different for the same character, but they all look the same. All the Inori stories are the same, for example, so... I only need to take a picture of it once. But that's fun. We'll see uh, what kind of characters we get uh, tomorrow. And then I'm going to do another uh, pull video tomorrow. There's some different stuff that I want to pull. Okay, but here, today only, is a 5-unit uh, guarantee 10-shot for free, so let's pull that. Uh, there's really nothing that I want. <laughs> the, uh, the Crystal Fest units, of course, are not in here, so... I guess I could hope for the, uh, the UR characters that are getting the uh, EX jobs this month, so like uh, Sakura or Raldor. Alright, Charlotte, Victora, Howlett, Charlotte. These are all going to be good for uh, Mog Metals, so yeah, can't complain. <laughs> and Orodoa, okay, great. Okay, so there's that. Get the Mog Medals. Uh, no stars because it is a free pull. Okay, next we have Arstoria's release. Uh, I checked the rates uh, for him. He has the, uh, the 0.4, so I was hoping it was going to be 0.8. They would make it higher for the, uh, the New Year, but yeah, same as always. Um, so I'm not going to be pulling very hard for him. I'll do the discount pulls and then call it a day. So this is a, a handout ticket here. Vision car, that's definitely not him. <laughs> I'd also like to pull Barris, uh, the ice healer. I think I could uh, make use of him. All right, I'll do the, uh, the daily discount for uh, our story as long as he is available. We'll see if we get lucky. Although, even if I pull him here, I think I would slow build him. I'm actually more interested in uh, building up uh, Setia. If I can show her off a little bit before uh, global release, I think that would be good. Alright, I had a heart attack with that pull, but just kill Faye. <laughs> uh, but that was paid, so we'll get the uh, stars there. Okay, and then I bought the uh, the discount 10-shot ticket for 300 paid. These have been good to me. Unit, that's good. 
Not rainbow. Okay. This is almost guaranteed to be a dead shot. Right, change to yellow, okay. Not even any MRs, oh well. Okay, so next banner. Uh, here, for four days, the other four uh, Crystal Warriors will get pickup banners, so if you really wanted one specific, you could pull in there. Uh, hopefully they do this for global. Uh, I hear a lot of people want Zazan or like Elena or stuff, so yeah. Uh, here's an interesting step up. Three step, uh, paid vision ore. On the third step you'll get a uh, Crystal Warrior guaranteed. I would want to get Arstoria or Barris, but that's less than 50% chance, so yeah, we'll skip that, I think. And then the uh, typical five step, you get the uh, shards at the end there. I'm gonna skip that. Here, you can get Mind Spheres of the uh, unit of your choice. Um, I want to do this for Setia, and I did this after uh, recording this video. Didn't get anything, but I did get the uh, 80 Mind Spheres. I thought that was a good deal. And I'm checking the uh, rates here just to see if they are in the pool. Uh, yes, they are, but no pickup, so yeah. Okay, next. Uh, five URs. Guaranteed. You can repull once. I'm going to skip that. Uh, Violet is released today. I'm going to skip her too. She looks cool, and uh, Light Evade is fun, but uh, I think I'm going to skip her. But they did give the uh, handout ticket, so let's pull that. Unit, good. Ugh. <laughs> All right, Valide. All right, there's the limit break animation, very cool. Next, you can get Mind Spheres for Persona 5. I'm going to skip uh, leveling up Queen, uh, but here is the new vision card. I think I'll do the daily pulls for this, and then here's a look at the stats. 50% uh, gain AP, 18% luck, and then uh, 20 light resistance, all for light units. And then personal ability, uh, light attack up, and then luck up 10. So actually the total luck, if you look at the uh, party and the personal, is about the same as um, Kiton's Secrets of the Heart luck card. And then you get a lot of other benefits for uh, light units, but I'm not going to pull hard for this one. Okay, nothing there. And then a uh, limited time too, so that's kind of sucky. <laughs> but let's do the uh, the discount daily pulls. Yikes. A lot of blue pulls today. Alright, next. This is very interesting. Uh, this is a 10 shot with uh, 10 URs guaranteed, and then it only draws from those four elements that we see there. Uh, water, light, wind, and ice. And then you can re-pull it 10 times. <laughs> uh, I don't want any characters, I want uh, vision cards. And um, that is Chaos Odin that we see there. I saw somebody do the math, if you re-pull 10 times you have a 25% chance of getting uh, Chaos Odin. That would be cool to uh, knock that out here. And um, I'm also looking at other uh, vision cards that I don't have. So uh, Floaty Ball and then Chaos Odin, those are the two that I would want from here. But I'm not going to pull this today, because tomorrow we get a uh, kind of a free pull, similar to the five free units. We get five free vision cards. 
I could possibly pull one or both of the cards that I want uh, there and then save myself the trouble of pulling this one. So um, tomorrow, that will be in tomorrow's video. And then uh, later on, a few days, there's another uh, similar uh, hatcher which will feature the other four elements and then I could maybe get uh, different vision cards there. So that might be an even later future video. This one's interesting too. 10 vision cards, you can re-pull once. But uh, I'll wait till I pull the other ones. And I think that's it. So next, let's look at the shop. I wanted to show you the, uh, the Crystal Fest shop. And uh, this works out perfectly. This will be right before the, uh, the Crystal Fest appearance in uh, Global. But we go here. Uh, we can see shards for all of the uh, Crystal Warriors available. And I feel like I've bought one of the 40 packs for Setia before. It might have refreshed, but yeah, as we can see, Joom is no longer available. I bought all those. So maybe it doesn't refresh, actually, but yeah, you can get these anytime. So I'll get two of those now. That way I can fully awaken Setia. And then I'll show you the Mog Shop as well. Uh, but here we can uh, go to the ceiling and then get uh, Arstoria. Or we could get shards for anybody. Uh, ceiling is only available for the, uh, the current uh, featured character. So you wouldn't be able to uh, save up medals for uh, from one hatcher to go to the next. Somebody asked if the medals carried over, and I didn't know, but it looks like they don't, so yeah. Uh, but the selection does carry over, so we can see that Setia is down to 72. All right, let's get some Setia Mind Spheres. Screw you, Zazan. <laughs> All right, very good. And to end the video, let's uh, awaken Setia. Now in here, I just favorited all of the uh, standard pool cost 100 units, uh, just to brag and show off. <laughs> all right, there we go. I'm really looking forward to using the team of Mont, Setia, and then Terra, and then take them against uh, Evade teams. I think that would be fun. All right, and then uh, after this video ended, I uh, took her to 115 uh, with all of the other stuff uh, available. Okay, that'll do it for this video. We'll see you tomorrow when I do that uh, 10 retries hatcher. All right, thanks for watching, and we'll see you again. Take care.